Hi, my name is Ali, and today I'm going to share a short story that Jesus told in the Bible. However, before I do that, I'm quickly going to explain a meaning of one of the words that this story uses. And the reason I'm going to do that is I think it will really help us to understand what the story means. So to do that, I'm just going to quickly share my screen. So if you look here, I'm sure you all know what this is. I'm sure you've all had that at Christmas time or maybe on your birthday. Um, I love Cadbury Milk Tree. But I wonder if you've ever seen what's in this little circle bit here. It looks like a little badge. And what that badge means is it's something that the royal family has approved. So in other words, it's Milk Tree. And milk tree is chocolate that's fit for a king or queen. So why am I saying all this? Well, in the story today, um, we'll see the word justified. And what that means is that one of the characters in the story gets God's stamp of approval, a bit like that badge we saw in the chocolate. He gets God's stamp of approval. So I'm quickly going to read that story. To some who were confident of their own righteousness and looked down on everybody else, Jesus told this parable. Two men went up to the temple to pray, one a Pharisee and the other a tax collector. The Pharisee stood up and prayed about himself, God, thank you that I'm not like other men, robbers, evildoers, adulterers, or even like this tax collector. I fast twice a week and give a tenth of all I get. But the tax collector stood at a distance. He would not even look up to heaven, but beat his breast, saying, God, have mercy on me, a sinner. I tell you that this man, rather than the other, went home justified. Remember that? justified. Remember that means, remember that um, mark of approval we saw in the chocolate. This man, rather than the other, went home justified before God. For everyone who exalts himself will be humbled, and he who humbles himself will be exalted. <laughs> 